Welcome back to another video. It's the third one I posted today. Apologies for the spam, but there is tons of information coming our way from Moyang. The next stuff is really exciting. It's from Dinnerbone, and he says, This is a super big spoiler of what I'm working on. Totally unfinished, but may change a lot. And he links to this image, an upside down smiley face. Then he posts out another tweet saying, OK, I think my web server proxy messed up. Technology is difficult. Here's a more fun image in a zip. So, over on Reddit, you can find um, some discussion about what is inside this zip file. Supposedly, it's hidden inside the image. They guess the password, which is supposed to be advancements. And then a bunch of JSON files will come out of that. And I haven't checked out this thread right here, but what I'm about to tell you, I don't fully understand. This is my interpretation based on reading what other people are saying and looking at this myself. But there appears to be four different files here, and I believe there are three different things that we are looking at. One of them is custom crafting recipes coming to the game, and we can manipulate, change, and add those using JSON files, I believe. Another thing is something called advancements, which we'll get to in a second, and then there's also, I believe, custom achievements as well. So being able to create your own achievement tree. Now, the advancements are a little bit tricky to explain. But if we have a look here, there is a reward, which is a recipe, because we now have custom recipes as JSON files. This will be a chest, a regular chest. And there is some criteria in which to create the advancement. And that is to have a slightly full inventory, which requires nine occupied slots within your inventory. And then when you do that, you will get the recipe. Uh, apparently, if you already have the recipe, it is unlocked or something like that. I don't really understand fully what I'm reading, but I believe that to be relatively accurate of what an advancement is. You're able to specify what's happening in the game, i.e. the inventory having nine slots occupied, and then being able to give the player something in return. In this case, it is a recipe. I don't know if you could give them items for doing things. If you can, the more options there are here, this is incredibly powerful stuff for custom maps and map makers, and really it can just bring a whole new level of life to custom games within Minecraft. So there's this thing called Upgrade Tools as well, and I believe this is an achievement, even though it's in the Advancement folder here, because it has an icon, and uh, that icon is for using the stone pickaxe, and it's called Upgrade Tools, and I believe it's just about um, using using a regular pick to mine a stone block, if I remember correctly. I've just read all this a moment ago and try to explain it. I'm not 100% sure if I'm getting it right or not. Um, hmm. Something along those lines anyway. And then scrolling down, we can see in the recipes folder, book.json describes the shapeless recipe where all you need is paper, 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 and leather. Right, and then there's another one here where it's shaped, and you describe the pattern in lines, I believe. Actually, I'm not quite sure what that means or to what part of the grid that refers to, but it tells you where you're putting um, your sticks and your golden ingots. In fact, now that I think about it, it's describing the X is like two X's side by side, then the third one there, so that's three ingots, and then the hashes are your sticks. And of course, there are only two each time because you could put that in one side of the crafty bench or the other. So that is another description of a recipe there. So three things, three very exciting things, custom crafting recipes, custom achievements, and advancements. Hopefully I got all of that right, and this video has been a lot longer than usual. I tried to make them around a minute, but there was a lot to talk about, and uh, we'll learn much more about this when the snapshot comes out next week, which I'm looking forward to. But that's it from me this video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.